I am Tega Joy and I'm recording this video from the UK. What God cannot do does not exist. So I joined this prayer platform on um, August 25th, 2021 and since then I have not looked back. So I've recently been applying for jobs and on Monday the 10th of January I got a call from a recruiter and she said she was impressed with my CV and that she would like to pass it on to the hiring manager. She explained um, it would be a, a two-step interview. So the first one would be with the hiring manager and the second one would be um, a panel interview. And I said, okay, uh, book me for the interview, it's fine. Um, so I had, I had my first um, interview on Tuesday, 11th um, January with the hiring manager. And um, it was more of a CV review, you know, like just a CV work through to understand, um, you know, what I've done in the past. At the end of it, I didn't feel very confident with the answers that I gave. I thought I should have, you know, structured it a little bit more better. But um, I just told myself, you know what, I've done my part and I'm leaving the rest to God. I'll practice better for the second interview, like if I was to go through. So when, Wednesday, the 12th of January, like early in the morning, my phone was ringing nonstop. So I called back. I called the number back and it was the recruiter lady that I initially spoke to. And she asked me, oh, how did your interview go? I said, I thought it was okay. And then she asked, oh, do I have any more interviews with other companies booked up? At this point, like literally, my heart just sank because I was like, ah, what's it done? I didn't get it. I didn't make it. Then she said, the manager was so impressed with your CV and the answers that you gave, he was so amazed that like you blew his mind with your answers. Like he was so impressed, he decided to cancel the second interview <laughs> and he would like to offer you the job i said just like that and she was like yes mind you this is the uk we're talking about like they follow processes and protocols to the letter make a use pigeon token in case you know you never hear the oibo and they speak sense <laughs> the woman say because of you they don't change the process when get the day in place. They don't change and they don't cancel the second one. Like they don't give you the job. Hey. Okay, so interesting fact. This is a career change for me. Like I don't have um, qualifications or experience for this um, role or for this um, industry. So I know for a fact that I wouldn't be you know, the most qualified person that applied for the job, but I was the preferred. Like Pastor Jerry was saying, for your sake, protocols will be broken. Hey, I start my new role on Monday, 31st January. Secondly, um, on Monday, 24th January at um, 6.07 a.m. UK time, Pastor Jerry gave a word of knowledge. He said, I don't know who you are. They have not replied you all this while. You see today, by the miraculous power of God, receive your reply. It is ending in your favor. So I've been waiting for reply um, from the home office. And at 9 12 a.m. UK time on the 24th of January, I got an email saying my citizenship has been granted. It has been back to back earlier than expected miracles. I have my evidence so on this altar of fire. I just want to say thank you to Pastor Jerry, Mommy Eno, Pastor Ugo for your sacrifice, you know, being here every single morning on this altar of fire to intercede for us. May God continue to bless you. What God cannot do does not exist. Thank you.